can't believe prom is only a few days away. Yeah, right after we graduate. <laughs> Sorry, um, most of us graduate. It's okay, I've made my peace. I'm just excited to spend prom night with the two most gorgeous girls at Degrassi. Now, if we could only find you an equally gorgeous pair of shoes. Oh my God, Charlie. Is that a shoe store? No, my ex, over there. Where? Over there, over there. don't draw attention. <laughs> Fiona. Damn. <laughs> hey! I thought that was you. How are you? Great. I'm doing my first art show tomorrow. Um, I gotta get back to work, but I'd love it if you guys came. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Bye. So, she seems to be over any awkwardness. Yeah, she does. You're not actually thinking of going, are you? No, of course not. Charlie and I are complicated. <laughs> Please tell me that's a cheat sheet for the history exam. Better. It's finally arrived in the mail this morning. You're looking at a future private Army McPherson. You got into the Army. That's crazy. I leave for basic training in a few days. Can you do all this physical stuff? Physical stuff? Well, it says here, basic training may be the most demanding experience of your life. You must pass a fitness test in order to be considered for the forces. Let me see that. You'll be up before sunrise. You'll do push-ups, sit-ups, and chin-ups. So many ups. I worked so hard for this chance. We need to celebrate. I know a hot chalk that wants to take you to prom. Me, really? What about Zane? You know we broke up. I'm moving on. Well, then it's a date. Suddenly my history exam doesn't seem so scary. <laughs> Okay, so the limo is gonna cost us 40 bucks each, but 50 if we go for the stretch SUV. What do you think? Fiona, SUV limo, tacky or classy? Charlie seemed like she was doing well yesterday, right? You're not having second thoughts about going to her art show. No, I'm just happy she's happy. Ladies, do we have room for one more in the limo? Another lady going stagette? Uh, no, a guy. Actually, Riley asked me to go with him. <sighs> okay, fine. At least Holly J and I will have each other. Fiona, I'm so sorry. Sav asked me to be his date last night as co-presidents. And you said yes? Well, I thought you'd have Anya. Great, so I'm the odd one out. Maybe we can find you your own date. Where? Lesbianpromdate.com? Or you can go alone. As long as we're all together, what does it matter? Everyone, find your seats according to grade. Exams are on your desks. Three down, one to go. Three more days, then it's sunshine and beaches. Here I come. Yes, <laughs> sounds nice. Have you talked to Drew yet? Not since you aired my dirty laundry to the whole school. I said I'm sorry. I know, but he can't believe I forgave you so easily. Maybe you should make the first move. Offer him some one-on-one -on -one exam tutoring. If Drew can't accept my best friend, then maybe we're not meant to be. Hey. Gotta go. See ya. Are you okay? Marisol and I have been best friends forever. I know. And if you can't accept that, then you and I can't be together. I know. Wait, what? I might not get girl friendships, but you're loyal. And I like you a lot. Really? 
Well, turns out I might be looking for a date to prom. Elevens are allowed to go? Well, more people means more cash, means bigger party. Well, if you want the night to be truly special, I'm your guy. Why so glum, chum? I think I failed my history exam. Is there anything I do to cheer you up? Be my date to prom? <laughs> Didn't think I was your type. All my friends are going with friend dates this year. You're the only friend I have left at Degrassi. Well, friend, I'd love to, but I've already weaseled my way in. You got a date? Well, not exactly. Adam volunteers to be servers. <laughs> I'm just gonna have to accept the fact that life at Degrassi is gonna be lonely from now on. Come on, there has to be someone you want to go to prom with, someone who's not just a friend. Yeah, there is someone. A certain scooter-riding girl. Name rhymes with gnarly. And I'd appreciate it if you can keep your wise-ass comments to yourself. Whoa, is someone serious? Uh. Okay, look. I know you think I'm pathetic, but I need your help. Are you kidding me? I don't help cokeheads. So that's what you think of me. Look, my coke era is over. It's in the past. I want to forget about it. Yeah, me too. I made it into the army. But if I can't do one lousy chin-up, I'm not going to cut it. And you're serious about this? Never been more serious about anything in my life. You'd have to be 100% committed, do everything I say. No, I, I will. Totally committed. Okay. Get ready to sweat. Guess who gets to go to prom with her main guy? You're going with Drew. Is that okay? Uh, depends. Are you allowed to be friends with me? He's over it, and he might want to be friends with you. Then have fun at prom. <laughs> <laughs> so are you ready for it? For what? Uh, afterwards, sex. How did you get sex from a prom date? Did he at any point say the word special? Yeah, but... OMG, you are going to lose your virginity! <gasps> Drew is not like that. He took Bianca to the boiler room. Oh. <sighs> well, you don't have to do anything you're not ready for. I wasn't going to. Drew's sweet. He seen me at my worst and he still likes me. But he'll at least expect some clothing optional activities, no? Oh my god, Mayor. <laughs> He's only the second guy I've ever kissed. Soon to be the first guy who you've ever had. Enough! Sex. I'm not ready. What am I gonna do? Uh, other than tell him the truth? No. Something better. in the zone, totally just painting away in your trees and stuff. I just, I'm really sorry. You're gonna slow down. <laughs> well, I, I came because I can't stop thinking about how awful I was to you. It was so unfair of me to just invite you to move in and then kick you out for no reason at all. We both rushed into things too soon. 
Still, I should have been honest with you about being an alcoholic. It's in the past. You know, after things ended, I channeled my heartbreak into art, and now I'm putting on a show. So what you're saying is I did you a favor? You were kind of my inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, how's living with Mom? Uh, tense. No surprise there. Charlie, that sucks. Well, it's okay, I can handle it. Worst part is, is that she kicked Mr. Tuxedo Pants out, so... Poor guy's cooped up in that gallery. Oh, poor little kitty. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Tuxedo Pants could stay with me for a few days. Really? Are, are you sure? Yeah, I mean, he'll be right at home and I could use the company. Oh, that would be huge. How could I ever pay you? Well, you could be my date to prom. The thing to do this year seems to be to go with a friend. I, I know it's lame high school stuff and if you don't want to go, I totally get it, but... I think that's a yes. <laughs> Just the person I wanted to see. Someone's in a good mood. What's to be glum about? The sun is shining, exams are over, and prom's a few days away. You've been drinking? I'm three months sober, thank you very much. Sorry, I shouldn't joke. I know you've been doing so well. Okay, well, I'm just getting this place ready for Mama Coin. She's flying in tomorrow morning. I've been thinking about this prom date thing. I can tell Sab to find another date. No need to fret, Holly J. I've found a friend date. Oh, who's the lucky friend? Charlie, and before you rain on my parade, it's just as friends. God, Fiona. Well, would you rather me spend the whole night being a third wheel? You won't be a third wheel. Yeah, you're right. I'll be a fifth wheel or a seventh wheel. No, no one's going to be a wheel. This isn't just about prom, Holly J. Once you're off at Yale next year, I'm going to need a friend. Okay, well, are you sure that Charlie is looking at this as just a friend date? I'm going to her art show tonight. If it looks like things are complicated, I'll call it off. Good Lord, is that her cat? That I can explain. Okay, I've been on this thing for like an hour. How much longer do I have to stop? What's that? You want to go faster? No. Huh? Stop it! Oh, I'm going to be sick. Well, you're training for the army, not the ice capades, McPherson. Let's go. Oh, okay, this isn't training. This is torture. God. Just like ease into this, you know, with baby steps. Or... Can you climb a 15 foot wall? No. Can you do a 15K run in army gear? Not yet. Well, then but... you don't have time for baby steps. I need a minute. Okay, well, if you want to quit, I've got better things I could be doing with my time. I assure you. I am not a quitter. Good. Push ups. Let's go. Come on. No, no, no. On your toes like a man. One. Two, two. Oh, I hate you. Two. Specifically the lighting to have it on one side mm -hmm. as opposed to having it. I'll be right back. You came! <laughs> Uh, and I forgot to mention that there'd be alcohol. No, I'll be fine. Wow, look at you. <laughs> Are you sure? Totally. Okay, good. Because <laughs> there's something I want you to see. Okay. <sighs> so, what do you think? Did the artist do her subject justice? Charlie, it's... It's breathtaking. <laughs> well, I can't take all the credit. It's easy when the model looks like you. Oh, there are a lot of people here. <laughs> and not one painting is sold. I've reapplied deodorant twice. I'm so anxious. Well, it's early. I'm sure things will pick up. I mean, who wouldn't want this face in their living room? Yeah, I couldn't agree with you more. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt. There is a man that's really interested in painting number 15. A meeting with the artist might seal the deal. I really need this. I'll be right back. Oh, uh, excuse me. Are you the person to ask about buying a painting? <sighs> hey, 
Um, I've been thinking about us, and I want to get to know you better, so I have a few questions. Shoot. What's your favorite movie? Fast and the Furious, five. What's your favorite book? Pass. What's your favorite food? Hot dogs, no, pizza. Have you been checked for STIs? Huh? STIs, chlamydia, gonorrhea. I, I know what STIs are. Wait, you want to have sex? Um, yeah, one day. Sure, yeah, um, of course I'll get tested. Great, um, I'll need to know from your doctor. Cool, I'll give him a call. All right, um, well, it might take a little while for the results to come back, like, days, weeks even. You see, this is what I like about you. You've always got a plan. Most girls are way too afraid to even talk about sex. Nope. Not me. Better safe than sorry, right? <laughs> And 50. Did you see that? I just, I just did it. <laughs> Do you still think I'm pathetic? Should have more faith in you. I'm really glad that uh, we could do this. I couldn't leave with you hating me. I could never hate you, Anya. It's just that when you were on your coke binge, you were ruining something amazing. I was in a dark place. I know. I like this, Anya. Strong, confident, sexy as hell. I'm, I'm really gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you too. Um, I have something that I want to show you. Wait here. Okay. Congratulations, Fiona Coin. Dude said he'd think about it, and then he asked for my number. <laughs> this is the worst. Oh my God. Did this just... Fiona? I thought, who better to buy a painting of me than me, right? You really didn't have to do that. <sighs> Thank you. Fiona's purchase will create a buzz. Get other people to buy. Totally forgot to introduce you guys. Um, Meredith, this is the Fiona coin. Fiona, this is my girlfriend, Meredith. Oh, it's so nice to meet you. <laughs> Charlie's told me so much about you, but I must say you're even more gorgeous in person. So, the two of you are going to prom. It's gonna be so cute. <laughs> You're gonna have to find something to wear. Yes. Maybe you can, you can borrow something of mine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm thinking black dress. Strapless. You are gonna look gorgeous. <laughs> I'm gonna have to take photos. Speaking of photo ops, excuse us, Fiona, it's time for Charlie's toast. Oh. Thank you so much, Fiona. You're such a good friend. I would like to raise a toast to the incredible, beautiful, talented Charlie Lima. You ready? The anticipation is killing me. McPherson reporting for duty. What do you think? <laughs> it's the first time I put it on. It's the first time I really feel like I deserve to. Like the smallest bone. You know that I'm, I'm leaving the day after prom, right? Uh, then we're gonna make these last.
last few days as amazing as they can be. Starting with who do I gotta beat up to take you to prom? Well, he's a jock. And he is strong. I mean, like, really strong. But I'm sure that Riley won't mind. When there's only you in my world And we'll only talk Cause I say things are You're as far from me As the farthest star On how I wonder Wonder who you are When there's oh, only Don't look at me that way, Mr. Tuxedo Pants. Can't talk to her right now, not like this. I'm sorry, it's not your fault. No, I don't deserve you. I don't deserve anyone. Holly J is leaving me. Charlie doesn't love me. I'm unlovable. Oh, Tell me why, baby, go, why, go for your own good. baby, why? Make me cry, baby, cry. You need to learn how to be alone. Cry. I tell you no lie, baby, lie, baby, lie. I'm gonna cry, baby, cry, baby, cry. Whatever it takes I know I can make it through And if I hold out I know I can make it through I know I, I know I can make it through